Hey everybody, Mandy Taylor here with the TheMightyCloth.biz. This one's going to be a little bit hard to film because the light is directly behind me and there's nothing I can do about that. Um, I want you guys to be able to see what I'm looking at, so just bear with me. I'm not a professional camera person. I'm just somebody that sells Norwex. So this one is one of my very, very favorites. So this is our um, dusting mitt. This one is blue. They come in blue and green. And this one is wet. I just took it over to the sink and got it really, really wet. Rang it out. It's wet on both sides. Okay. What I'm going to do is clean the um, window screens and the window sill from the inside. I know when I was a kid, I used to, my dad would always you know, get the ladder out, take all the screens down, we'd hose them all down, scrub them all down. Mostly he did the work and we just complained about it. Take the ladder, put them all back up again. It was not a fun job. I, in my adult life, have never done that because I'm too lazy. But now I have an alternative. So if you're somebody that has been doing that and your kids hate it, or you don't want to do it anymore because you hate it, or maybe you've never done it because you're lazy like me, but you want your, clean, your screens and your sills to be clean, this video is for you. Okay? So you take a damp uh, dusting mitt and put it on your hand. All right, and then we've got a dirty window. Okay? So, make sure the angle's right, okay? So, this is a clean, wet dusting mitt, okay? All you do is gently wipe down the screen. This is great for allergy season, um, when there's a lot of pollen in the air. All right, and that is just the screen. You can see the outline of my hand. Just the screen, no pressure, that's just the dirt and lint and pollen and everything that was on the screen. Okay, now what you can't see from this angle is how gross the windowsill is. Okay, can you see that? Okay, really, really super gross, right? And um, these windows were put in a year ago, maybe two years ago, probably two years ago just about two years ago, okay? And I don't think I've cleaned them since. So, you can see down here in the track, all the crud. You can see over on the sides. Uh, can you see? Over here we've got like spider webs and like little cobwebs and stuff, okay? So I'm gonna take that same little, you know, half dirty, okay? I'm just gonna wipe down. You can wipe underneath, you can wipe wherever you want. So I'm just gonna wipe over here, get in this little track, these windows, obviously, like I just said, were new, so they clean up really, really nicely. But you can see now, there's no cobwebs or anything funky in that little track. Okay, I'm going to leave Mr. Wasp. He can just stay there for now. I don't feel like dealing with him. And now I'm going to show you the track. Okay, so all you do, or the sill. I should be able to talk, but, you know, I'm very pregnant. I don't, I have little kids. Sometimes my speech is not as good as it could be. Okay, can you see this coming up? This is no chemicals. This is not using 700 rolls of paper towels. Okay. All right, can you see this? Gross. Okay, we're not even done yet. Okay, so I'm gonna start from the other side. Okay, and then there's dirt back here on the screen itself. So I'm gonna get in that little track. Okay, gonna get over here. This track over on this side. All right, and at this point, it's really, really dirty. I mean, like, uh, let's see if you can see. Come on, camera. Work with me here. There we go. There we go. Okay. So we've got lots of crud on that side. Lots of crud on this side. Okay. Rotating over. Like, this is really gross, yeah? Okay. And we've got some touch-ups that need to be done on the sill. So all I'm going to do is just kind of tuck this dirty part under in my hand. Crazy camera. Okay, I'm gonna take it off of my hand. More crazy camera. 
there. I'm just going to fold it over like this. So now I've got sort of a nice clean surface that hasn't been yucked up yet. Okay. I'm just going to kind of finish up. After I'm finished with this, I'm just going to take it over to the sink and rinse it off. Come back and do the, the final, final step. Okay. And this stuff you just kind of gather in your hand like so. All right. I'm going to pause this, rinse it out, and I'll be right back. All right. Quick rinse. And we're back to new again. Okay, this is where we left off. Um, I think you can actually even open up these um, the screen. Let me see here if I can get that open real fast. Look at that. All right, so throw this guy back on my hand. Play with my camera some more. So all I did was just lift up the screen. Okay, but now I can get everything down here and all the stuff that was at the very bottom that was um, kind of gunky and hard to hard to reach when it was down there. If I go over that track, I can go over the bottom now. Can you see how clean this is? Okay, and now all the stuff that was left on the sill And if you're smarter than I am, and do this more than once every two years, it'll be even easier. But I'll tell you what, this, in my opinion, is way easier than getting on a ladder, getting all the screens, getting them off the house, hosing them all down, scrubbing them down, and putting them all back up again. So now put this back down. You can see nice clean windowsill. There is still some um, funk like right in the corners. Um, I'll just grab an Enviro cloth and finish that off. Really, I won't. I'm just gonna leave it like that because that's good enough for me. But if I were somebody that wanted to have it be absolutely perfect. I would just grab an Enviro cloth and stick my finger in the corner of the Enviro cloth and get all those little spots. But this is a bazillion times better than it was. So now I've got a clean screen and we've got a clean sill. And that was just using our wet dusting mitt. There's the final amount of dirt after we were finished. So hope this helps you. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.